Inside Montpelier High School, messages of peace and inclusion line the walls. But that's not always how some students feel. I think it's very fair to say that we're pretty much robbed of our education. Senior Joellen Mensa started the Racial Justice Alliance to fight for equality in education. As a black student, there have been many times where I have had to leave class because of some racist comments. Next month, the school will take a symbolic step towards real change. The school board unanimously approved their idea to raise the Black Lives Matter flag during Black History Month. The school board is taking a very courageous step in honoring the experience of our students of color, specifically of our black students. The superintendent says it's part of their move to create a more inclusive environment. I think our obligation as an educational community is to be a part of conversations around this. A conversation that extends far beyond the school walls. I just think it's a, a bad example for the Montpelier school board to uh, establish this president. State Representative Thomas Terenzini denounced the decision, calling Black Lives Matter a national anti-police organization. I don't think of myself uh, as being a bigot or prejudice, but I just don't think Black Lives Matter is a uh, is an organization, a national organization to look up to. While others think it draws attention to an important issue. It's easy to overlook the issue of, of racial disparity in this state because we are such a white state. It's completely on par with Vermont. We are leaders in so many ways. State Representative Kaya Morris believes Montpelier High School is the first public school in the country to do this. A really bold and courageous move. Still, the divide in opinion only makes Mensa more motivated to have this done. I feel like that is why um, it's even more important to fly the flag because people don't realize what is going on. The flag will go up next week for the entire month of February.